All right, and so we only really have one new movie that's coming out this weekend, and it's doing the hybrid release, being on HBO Max as well as in theaters at the same time, which is the Tom and Jerry movie. And honestly, I'm not looking forward to this movie. <laughs> I'm not looking forward, it, but I will go see it because I'm going to go take my son. And of course, I want to do a review on it because I may end up loving this film. I may end up really, really loving it or really, really liking it or just even liking it. I don't know, but I'm willing to check it out. But I'm definitely going to go take my son to go see it because he may end up liking it more than I do. And if he does, it makes it well worth it. But uh, yeah, it's just... I'm not really that extremely crazy over Tom and Jerry just at all. I mean, I've watched the shows, you know, when I was younger and everything else, especially Tom and Jerry kids or whatnot. Uh, but it's just I, I wasn't too, too crazy over Tom and Jerry. And it just got the question of, like, why is it a hybrid? Like, why is it doing the same thing that, you know, Who Framed Roger Rabbit did or, you know, uh, what's the, the Smurfs and everything else? Why couldn't it just be a straight you know, animated film, like, I don't know, like, I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm, I have these qualms with it, but it's like, I may end up liking it, I don't know, but I am looking forward to seeing Chloe Moretz, because she is just all around sexy, that's the only thing I'm looking forward to seeing this movie, is just seeing her, because just all around, uh, but it looks to have the same humor that the show did, the slapstick humor and everything else, so a lot of it, Hopefully it may work, if not all of it. I just hope that I get some type of enjoyment out of it. But you can really tell that it was made for kids, even though it does have a nostalgic feel for the adults and everything else. So I guess you could say it got something for everybody. Uh, it does come out this weekend, February 26th. And like I said, in the hybrid in theaters as well as HBO Max. So if you still don't feel comfortable with seeing it in theaters, you can just, if you have HBO Max, just cut it on there and then you'll be able to chill and watch it at home with your kids and uh but yeah as far as this this goes it's like yeah uh, i don't know ah I, I i hope that is good i hope i find some enjoyment out of it if i don't it's not because i'm just biased and i don't want to like it is because you know more than likely it just wasn't really meant for me it was just meant for my son like i said if he finds some enjoyment out of it then hey all is good with the world 